Hi everyone, Steffi here. Welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be trying out a new sheet mask and this one is made from By Nature. It's the Hydro Firm Lace Collagen Shot Face Mask. So I don't know what happened there. I just had a brain fart. Um, we're going to try this out and I'm very excited because it is a lace one and I talked about the Lace Your Face sheet mask. So I'm excited about this. It says on the front it's from New Zealand. The address on the back does say it's from United Kingdom. So is it from New Zealand? I don't know. It also says on here, I think it was on the front, New Zealand made since 2012. Girl, I don't know where you've been since 2012. I have never seen you. Hello. I, I have no idea what, hello. But I'm seeing this for the first time. The packaging is a little bit bulky. It almost feels like there are air bubbles in here, but it's, she's thick. She's a thicky. So it's either the mask itself because it's lace might be a little bit more bulky. There might be some air bubbles in here. I'm not really sure. Hopefully this isn't as drenched, drenched in product, but let's check it out on the back. Tone smooth and uplift with this hydro firm lace sheet mask infused with hyaluronic acid, collagen, coenzyme Q10 and vitamin E for a boost of nourishment and hydration your skin will love leaving skin fresh and re revitalized without nasty chemicals. It says key ingredients are hyaluronic acid and coenzyme Q10. Um, then it kind of talks about that, what it is. Also directions of use, it tells you how to use a sheet mask. And on this one, it says afterward, clean the skin with warm water, pat dry and enjoy the effects. So as I'm looking at the ingredients, the top three, first one is water, then glycerin, then aloe leaf juice. So those are all good ingredients in there. Um, there's a couple other like filler ingredients and then we get into the coenzyme Q10, vitamin E, and I don't know if this one is the hyaluronic acid. Caperlorohymeroxic acid, but it doesn't say hyaluronic acid in it. It does say the coenzyme Q10 is in it. It says there's fragrance in it. So this one's gonna have a little smell to it, which will be nice. We'll do a smell test. We'll also do a squeeze test when we're done and see how drenched this mask actually is. But I am very excited to use it. So now on to the part where we put the mask on. Okay, so we are ready to put the mask on. Let's see. This one does have two little, right here, little tear off strips. I'm not sure if you can see that. There you can. We're gonna try to tear this open. Actually tore off pretty nicely. Okay, let's see what we got here. Oh boy, she is a gooey mess. We're going to cover up the light so I can show you. She is ooey gooey in there. You can't really see that good. Let me see if I can open it up a little bit more and just show you what we have here. Maybe if I do a little bit of light. Yeah, so let's see. It is lace, I can see that. But oh my goodness. Like it's already all over my fingers. All right, what's with this foil backing, huh? What is the deal with this? Because this has some weird little plastic thing is that just oh we don't need that i guess we're just gonna put that down here okay this is not what i was expecting smells like flowers not exactly sure what kind of flowers but it does smell like flowers i can definitely say that Hmm. 
Hmm. Slippery. We all just love that, don't we? When it slides all over our face and it doesn't know where to go. Well, it's on, very saturated. We're gonna give her 10 minutes. And we will be good. I will be back. Okay, we are back. So before I take this mask off, I must say it's making my skin feel like really hot. It's also very tingly and kind of cooling at the same time. So the acid in here is definitely working. Also, this package is like, you hear that? There's so much product in here. All right, let's peel this off. Okay, so this is what it looks like off. I really thought this was going to be different than a regular sheet mask, but it's just the same. She's just the same. All right, so we already did our smell test. Now let's do our squeeze test. All right, there's a little bit. Here it comes. Come on. And the rest is all on my fingers. That's about it for a squeeze. So it's not like overly saturated in product. I mean, it's definitely there. I do have to go wash this off. So I'm going to go do that right now. And then I will let you know my thoughts on this mask and how I feel about it. So give me a minute. All right. So I have rinsed my face feels really smooth. It doesn't feel dry. Um, it just feels really smooth. That's about it. Um, I don't feel like I would go to bed without a moisturizer on still. I would still wear one and definitely use one. But, um, I mean, it doesn't feel like my face is dried out. Like I just use an alcohol wipe on it or anything like that. It did not really do anything for my acne though so maybe that'll change by tomorrow i guess we'll see my face still feels a little bit tingly um, i was excited to try this mask because of the lace aspect of it i thought it was going to stick to my face better uh, but it didn't you know it just kind of slipped around i mean that's kind of what you get with the sheet mask i mean it was really pretty and for only a couple bucks, I think it's a pretty good deal. Um, I've never did a collagen face mask before, or sheet mask, excuse me. I mean, it did do a little bit for my under eye, so that's good. So all in all, I'm going to give this product a three, because I feel like it did what it was supposed to do you know, but I just, I'm not really a huge fan of sheet masks in general. Um, this one definitely is not a favorite for me, but it is very affordable. It's just a new one. Maybe this is the way all collagen ones are. I don't really know, but I am going to give it three, um, just based on the fact that, you know, it wasn't what I expected. I expected something else and that's not what I got. You know, I expected something that was going to stick to my face and kind of stay there and it really didn't do that. So yeah, that's it. I'm going to give it a three. Um, this is going to be the end of the video just because I'm too lazy to record an outro later on with my makeup on. I'm ready for bed. So that's it for me. If you did like the video, go ahead and leave it a like. If you're new, please subscribe and I will see you next time.